guys welcome back to life with trini and if you're new welcome so today guys i'll be showing you how i edit and film on my iphone so when i'm filming on my iphone i use my back camera and the reason why i use the back camera is it is because it has a better quality than the front camera so i just rather to use it so when i upload it and the quality drops it is not as significant as it would be if i use my front camera so when i'm filming yes you're gonna say oh how am i going to see myself from the back put a mirror there i put a mirror in front of the phone so i can see myself i can glimpse at it and see if i'm in the center or wherever so when I'm finished filming on my iPhone, I'm going to screen record this. When I'm finished filming in my filming on my iPhone, I would then go to my editing app, which I use the iMovie. So it's right here, this little star right there. I use the iMovie app, and then when I go in. I press the plus sign which is for a new video and then I click movie and not trailer the trailer is what I used to make my um, intro video so I will just go ahead and select probably two videos and I'll click create and create is at the bottom of the phone so after I've done that, now I realize that I do not have my intro videos in. So I'll go to videos. Before that, I press the plus in the corner. There's a plus. So you click the plus, click video, and I go into favorites because that's where my intro video is. So and I'll click on the video that I want then click the plus that is in the circle to add it to the video and then when I go to the front as well there is no intro video so I do the same thing over the plus so here I am setting up in setting up the camera in my big orange dress like a vitamin C yes so I would so I would top top I would top on the video and press split because that's where I want to want to cut the video from. Then I will tap on the video that I don't need and press delete. Then I will watch the video to see the transition. But as you can hear guys, there is sound in the background from the TV but I didn't mind because I knew that I was going to do a voiceover for this video. As you can see, guys. So I will tap on the video again and press the speaker that is at the extreme bottom of the phone. So then I will tap the speaker and turn the volume down, which is off, and then. I will go from the start again and then no sound so what I am going to do as well because I normally add sound effects when I say hey guys welcome back to life with Trini and it's a Trini I normally add sound effects so I am going to add some sound effect right here so I would go to audio and then soundtrack, no, audio and sound effect, my bad. And I'll click the applause and then I'll click the plus in the circle. So here goes. And then I'll stop it about there. So to edit the sound, I'll tap, tap. Why do I keep saying tap? I'll tap on the blue line because this is the sound right here. So I'll tap on that and press split. And then the part that I don't need, delete. 
So this is how it's gonna be. And then that's it. So I'm going to split it right there. Tap, delete. And then let's see the transition. No, that's too sharp. So I'm gonna tap the little straight line in the square and click dissolve. So And then that's it guys. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. And that's how I edit my videos. And if I want to put a picture in the video, I would tap right here. I will add back. Don't tell me I'm not screen recording. Oh, I am. Thank you, Jesus. Back. Photos. Recently. Oh, I did not take a picture in the orange dress. But I will add a different photo. Picture in picture. So I will tap on the picture to position it and I'll put it about there. Tap on that, pinch the zoom. And that this is a totally different outfit, but I'm just showing you guys. So this is how it goes. And then that's it guys and then I'll just press done and I press done I will save the video I will press this little thing in the middle and save video and I always save my video to 4k because when I post it to YouTube I know the quality will drop a little bit so I don't want it to be such a big difference so I use 4k so even if it drops it will still look good yeah and now it says exporting and when that's done all I gotta do is go to my YouTube app, post my video, then y'all like, comment, share, and subscribe, guys. <laughs> Thank you for watching, guys. Mwah!